Holy Spirit of God, we worship you. Spirit of God, you're one with the Father and Son. We worship you, we worship you, we worship you. Doubt. What is the special time the Lord is giving to you to be with you, to fill you, to strengthen you? For me, it is from morning 4 o'clock to 7 o'clock. It's very interesting. 4 o'clock to 7 o'clock. She is waiting. But unfortunately, at 4 o'clock. <laughs> Maximum. 45 minutes she may wait. Before that, if I don't reach, she will go to another person. What can it do? So, I have experienced this for many years. Three hour personal prayer. If you want to successfully, if you want to be successful in the ministry, then you have to have a strong personal prayer. No, without that, in, in, the, in, the, in the past apostolic or the synod document Holy Father released for Europe, Ecclesia Europa, it's mentioned the personal prayer is the, is the breath of a Christian life, breath. It's our breath, personal prayer. But it's very sad. Even many people who are in leadership don't have time to pray. Don't have time to pray. Then we are fighting. Yes, we are fighting without shield. So that's why we will fail. We will fail. I don't take the names, but you know many big, big leaders miserably failed. We don't criticize them, we don't judge them, but we should learn from them. Why and what is the reason? And what I found is they become so busy that they had no time to pray. They start fighting without the shield. Okay. So after sanctification, then empowerment. Empowerment is three areas. First is the fruits of the spirit, fruit of the spirit. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. I will not ask you. In one place I asked how many of you know by heart nine fruits. Very few people raised the hand. I will not ask this because it will be very embarrassing <laughs> if somebody. But remember. It should be on your lips. Love, joy, peace. Love. Suppose sometimes we may not get three hours or you may get only two hours or you may not get any time, only 15 minutes. Then first you should pray, Lord, sanctify me. I surrender all my impurities, soul, mind. I surrender my conscience. Sanctify me. Wash me, Lord, with the precious blood, Holy Spirit. Then fill me. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. At least you pray for this. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. If you have a habit of jogging in the morning, yes, love, joy, peace. 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 Pray. Pray at all times. If you are cutting potatoes, love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. Chapati, oh. <laughs> Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. <laughs> Shaving. Love, joy, peace. Love. Joy. Taking bath. Ah. Love, joy, peace. Love, joy, peace. It's very. It, 
all our daily activity should be connected with prayer prayer essential this see every day my normal time table is 4 to 7 then i have breakfast then i have shave and shower during this shave and shower time at least i have nobody to talk i mean there is no telephone at least i cannot everything is off then i have ah, yeah. it's a nice prayer time big big ideas comes at that time big big ideas then immediately i write down somewhere after the bath i write down many ideas comes during this shower because during the shower time i always remember about the living water living water fill me fill me fill me love joy peace love joy peace love joy peace patience kindness goodness faithfulness gentleness wisdom 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 all these things are very simple you know these are very simple why should we waste that time when we are in the toilet <laughs> when we are in the bathroom don't waste that time okay so what i mean is in every way when st paul say pray all time means don't miss any time <laughs> don't miss any time and in bombay it's very good you have lot of time traveling in train traveling in bus plenty of time to pray take a walkman with you then you can also listen the word of god i was doing this here and i remember i used to keep a card one small paper then every day i write one word of god then when i am standing in the queue for bus i take and read take and read take and read then inside the bus again i take and read one word of god then I, when i reach office i keep that in front of me then keep on looking <laughs> by evening this one word of god will be by heart by heart it's very easy for bombay because lot of time we have everywhere we have to stand in queue even <laughs> everywhere everywhere queue so don't waste the time when you are in the queue one word of god every day oh how much time we have wasted without so one word of god every day will give you 365 word of god by heart in one year that is enough to become a good preacher so in the personal prayer one step is this filling with the fruits of the spirit gives wisdom knowledge understanding then the third point those who are charismatic you should every day pray for anointing anointing of the charisms fill me lord with the gifts of the the charisms anoint me in charisms charisms of tongues charisms of interpretation charisms of prophecy gift of healing gift of deliverance gift of preaching gift of proclamation proclamation every day you have to sharpen the knife every day you pray anointing now okay time is up now is tea is ready yesterday we had some confusion somebody can check up if the tea is ready then we will so a small conviction we, along with this i want to share but it's very important conviction to anybody when we pray when we ask or i take a real example one person said oh brother pray for me i said you must pray yes i am praying nothing is happening then i asked whom do you pray oh, what question is this i pray to god <laughs> then second question i asked where is god what are you asking god is everywhere aha uh -huh. that is why your prayer is not answered
is there anywhere in this big bible is written that you pray to a god who is everywhere no you will not find the whole bible time and again and again telling god is with you see it's a very simple understanding but we human beings always think god is everywhere yes he is everywhere but what is the difference then why when we go into church every day the priest is reminding the lord be with you how many times in a holy mass you recollect how many times because it needs reminder because we always look out we don't look in <laughs> we have camera only towards out not towards in but in charismatic all great thing happen when we close our eyes when we close our eyes and see yes we can see god in us so first thing we must recognize three ways god exist in us god's presence in a human being there are three ways first is god is everywhere okay that god who is everywhere is the creator of heaven and earth he created everything he created the whole universe so he is in the universe he is in the plants and trees and dog and cat and rat and frog but after creating all these things god said now i will create something supernatural i will create man according to my image so he created man from the earth but he breathed in him and gave him a soul soul this is not everywhere that's the different this soul is not in rat and cat and dog and frog it is only in man what is the function of the soul what is the function of the soul that is the seat of god god want to sit in our soul king our soul is the seat of god our soul is the seat of god why he need a seat that's simple why he need a seat no we are a creature he is a creator how can creator sit inside the creature without another software <laughs> creator god he is creator so he condensed himself in such a way and he made such an arrangement inside one creature that is the human being that he made a soul that is only for him to sit only for him to sit but we put so many other things we like ha ah, very nice brand come on and we like very nice gold come on and then god came and he is not having a place he is sitting outside there is no place for him there is no place for him what to do even if you have gained the whole world what have you gained the whole beautiful world you gained is only creation it's all created by me you still did not gain me i am the creature give me some place to sit so our soul that's why every time we are reminded even the priest came to our house for house blessing after that he had some tamasha or he had some dosa idli and all or he had some eating then finally he is going then we pray father bless us especially all right now his all that tamasha has gone he became very serious he said the lord be with you see he is blessing but what how he start the blessing 
first he is reminding us the lord who is supposed to bless you is already with you almighty god bless you so this blessing god is blessing god is blessing he cannot do anything else other than bless and he dwells in our soul this is the second presence of god in us and the third this is very important for charismatics or any baptized christian a baptized christian is anointed to share the working of the mission or the priestly kingly and prophetic work of christ every christian every baptized christian is duty bound to do or to participate in the priestly kingly prophetic anointing of christ a gift and a duty gift and a duty seek you shall find so that is our anointing jesus said in john chapter 14 12 whoever believes in me shall do all that i do and greater things than i do whoever believes in me shall do all that i do and greater things than i do because i am going to my father he will send you another helper to be with you always to be with you always that is that is our baptismal anointing anointing to do the work of god so what is anointing anointing it means the power of god specially given to a person to do the work of god a person means all those who are baptized they have got this anointing but we in the charismatic we are recognizing the anointing and activating this anointing activating in your computer there is program but then it's not working why it's not activated you have to only put the password and click yes so the anointing is inside us every day you can activate this okay we stop here now let's close our eyes and make a small prayer oh holy spirit dwelling in my heart i thank you for my anointing through baptism you have anointed me to work as jesus himself that jesus said you shall do all that i do and greater things than i do release this anointing lord Shandala hala bala. Everybody, release this anointing. Release this anointing in us. Everybody, raise, stand up, stand up. Raise your voice. Lift up your hands and praise and loudly. Anoint, Lord. Release our anointing. Holy Spirit, praise you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Shandala hala bala ulaiya. Shandala hala bala ulaiya. Shiriya la bala ulaiya, hala bala ulaiya, shanda la hala bala ulaiya, shanda la hala 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 ulaiya. Clap our hands and praise. Shanda la hala bala ulaiya, shiriya la bala ulaiya. Release our anointing. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Come, Holy Spirit. Release our anointing, Lord. Lord is with us. Lord is with us. Yes, He is here. He is in each one of us. Yes, Lord, You are in us. You are in each one of us. <coughs> we praise You. We adore You. We glorify You. You are a mighty God. You are a holy God. Holy, 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 holy is the name of the Lord. Shanda la halabala ulaya. Hiri ala balam 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 balam.